Hey gamers! Today we're diving into the world of Marvel Rivals and tackling a crucial topic, sensitivity conversion. If you're coming from other hero shooters, this video is for you. So, Marvel Rivals is shaking things up with its third-person perspective, and that means we need to adjust our aim. Let's break it down for you. For Overwatch 2 players, multiplying their current sensitivity by 0.375 provides a good starting point in Marvel Rivals. For example, if your Overwatch sensitivity is 7, your Marvel rival sensitivity will be 7 multiplied by 0.375, which is 2.625. Valorant players need to multiply their sensitivity by 4 to account for the significant difference in field of view between the games. For example, if your Valorant sensitivity is 0.65, your Marvel rival sensitivity will be 0.65 multiplied by 4, which is 2.60. Those coming from Apex Legends should multiply their sensitivity by 1.255. This means that if your Apex Legends sensitivity is 2, your Marvel Rival sensitivity will be 2 multiplied by 1.255, which is 2.51. Deadlock players use a factor of 2.515. If your Deadlock sensitivity is 1.03, your sensitivity value for Marvel Rivals will be 1.03 multiplied by 2.515, which is 2.59. These conversions aim to maintain a similar mouse movement experience across games, but fine-tuning is often necessary. It's important to note that Marvel Rivals gameplay is more dynamic, emphasizing speed and tracking over angle holding and flicking common in some other shooters. This may require further sensitivity adjustments. Additionally, players used to lower sensitivities might benefit from slightly increasing their settings in Marvel Rivals to better handle the game's fast-paced action and wide field of view. That's it for today's quick guide. Drop a comment if you have any questions, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more gaming tips. See you in the Marvel Universe.